A group of graduate students from Switzerland is researching how Chamorros speak English and is looking for more participants. PNC's Rizal Romanis has more in this report. Are you Chamorro and have lived in Guam for most of your life? Well, a research group from Switzerland would like for you to participate in their study called English in Paradise. I'm kind of part of a research group from Switzerland and we are all interested in the English that's spoken in Micronesia. But I'm specifically focusing on the English on Guam. So I'm kind of looking for people that were born and raised here, um, mostly with a Chamorro background. And then I will talk to them casually and then kind of record um, and collect what their speech sounds like. We ask of all places and coming from Switzerland, why study English in Micronesia? The thing about Micronesia is that it's, it just has a very interesting colonial past. I mean, the Japanese have been here, the United States, um, for some islands, Britain has been here, Germany, Spain, and that has all kind of influenced the languages. And so that's kind of interesting to us how that came to be and what that language then sounds like. Does it sound American? Does it sound Spanish? What does it sound like, you know? Mm. And that's why we're here. Researcher Eva says she's been on island for three weeks now and she plans to stay and meet more people from Guam before she leaves in August. I'm really liking it. It's very warm compared to Switzerland. Um, but I was just kind of amazed how open the people are and I can just talk to someone and they'll, they'll say, oh, Next Sunday we'll have a picnic, why don't you join us? And just this kind of openness I'm not used to and, and it's just incredible. It's really nice. Eva says for the study she records the entire conversation. Then she will listen and review how the participant speaks. One thing that I've noticed when, when I talk to people, even people that have left the island for years sometimes, they will, the way they pronounce the word family is very, very typical. Everyone says it the same way. It's in, this, in the United States, they would say family with an E, eh, you know? And then on Guam, they say family. Almost, it's that the mouth is more open, so it's a more open vowel. You say instead of family, you say family. Ah. Do you hear the difference? Mm -hmm. Eva says her team is planning on publishing a book after all the research. Saipan has been done. So one of my colleagues went last year. She went to Saipan and collected data. Uh, Kiribati. We have um, Nauru, Koshrai, and then quite a few years ago, a professor from Tokyo went to Palau and collected data there. Rosal Romanes, PNC News. And for those who want to participate in the study English in Paradise, Eva's email will be posted on our website at pacificnewscenter.com.